right, today I want to show you guys how you can transfer that my player DNA over to you know whatever roster you want. All right, so I have them no trainer. Make sure it's activated. If you're in my career, make sure it's activated. And then the next thing you do is press F10 to copy your roster. Now you can go back in game and you can just quit out of my career. Like I started a whole new my career because I deleted my previous my career because I never played it. Um, but so as of right now, I wasn't even signed to the Grizzlies yet. I was just that was the very first time you practice with your team. Um, but anyway, I'm going to go over to roster, not create roster, just basically like view roster. And since I'm not signed and I copied the roster and back to the main screen, going over to free agency and I'm going to scroll down and find my player. The player from my my, um, my my career. Here he is right here. Jackson. His name is just A Rock Good and has Jackson Ellis Cyberface. This was the player from my career. Now you guys, your players will have higher ratings if you if you're copying over a my career that you've been playing for months now. Um, it, but anyway, the next step I'm going to take is I'm going to back out of all of this. And I'm going to start a new season. All right, here we are. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, I'm going to just go over the season. I don't really care what the settings are when I start the season. It doesn't matter if I control all the teams or, or just one. Uh, my next step is... Go to front office roster, oh, not roster, um, free agents, and then I'll scroll down. My my player will still be in the free agents because we still have that copy roster option selected in Lemono Trainer. I've gone to edit player now, and now that I am able to access an edit player screen, I can pull up cheat engine, I can pull up my cheat table for DNA, and as you see here at the bottom of the cheat table it has the part one part two for your DNA so what I like to do is I like to open up a text file and open up cheat engine at the same time and I'll take the part one of the player DNA copy it over to the text file and then take part two of the DNA copy it over to the text file all right so from this point, um, what I am going to be doing is I'm going to paste this DNA into a new created player. Because right now, this isn't a created player. This is just a player in free agency. You know, you're my player in free agency. All right, so now I'm in create a player because you can go to create a player inside of a season or my league or whatever. Or you can just go back to the very main menu and go to create a player. So now I had accidentally uh, closed my cheat engine, but now I'm pulling cheat engine back up I'm with my DNA cheat table. I'm going to paste the part one information back into this part one. Click, I'm going to get all this info for part two of the DNA, copy it, double click over here, delete all of this on this line, and paste everything that was in Notepad. Press OK. All right, I'm going to back out of this and save. And that guy that you saw on the screen is now going to look like my player yeah here he is has has the same name and everything except for now this is inside of creator player now it does have that little um the g league symbol or whatever but uh it doesn't really matter because now um now i can since i have him in the creator player pool i'm going to show you that i can assign my my player to any roster i want all right. Let's see. Let's see. So.
so everything is pasted let me get out of this I don't know why I came to this screen I need to go to an actual roster so get getting out of this go to roster creator and then load up whatever roster you want your player to be on so I'm gonna go to my colleges all in one as you can see the college jerseys are already there when I load it up now I'm going to create a player pool I'm gonna copy into a team I'm gonna copy him to Michigan Wolverines then when I go back to the Michigan Wolverines still has that G League logo but I don't really care um, but yeah as you can see now my my player is here on the Michigan Wolverines and I can go inside of my league with player lock on and play with my same exact player that I have for my career because I've copied the DNA over alright so I'll see if I can get somebody's face scan but for now that is it for this video